Good morning. <laughs> I finally made it to the Namib Desert. Behind me is June 45. So we just had a stop here. We'll be having some coffee, breakfast because we woke up very, very early at 5 o'clock because we needed to drive. Yeah. So our tour guide is just preparing some breakfast for us and then yeah and this is my feet i'm wearing a two-piece from asos and then my bag <laughs> yeah in this life you must visit namibia i always tell myself that i left namibia to make money to be able to, <laughs> to tour my home country because I think I paid like two thousand, yeah, two thousand Namibian dollars uh, for this. So we got a car, a driver, and a tour guy. So he's to be explaining everything. Welcome to the Namib Desert. the gate mm -hmm. until here mm -hmm. it's known it's in 45 kilometers that uh -huh. is the reason the dune is known as in dune 45 oh. it's uh, uh, 171 meters high 171 mm -hmm. meters high right, yes it's and the each view is all about a landscape view uh, in so. the area okay yeah interesting eh <laughs> okay and this food that you were asking about, mm -hmm. you can also determine whether it's a male mm -hmm. or a female. By the look of, of the poo? By the look of the poo, it's mm -hmm. a male. How? And what the male does is, mm -hmm. males, they mark territories of the uh, poo, mm -hmm. of dung. Mm -hmm. And what if, if they mark territories? Mm -hmm. They mark territories. And if as they are walking, coming back, and if they come back, they churn on it, so that the other animals around in the area can smell that this area is protected. Ah, so because okay. when they come and churn on this poo, mm -hmm. in, as the wind are blowing in different direction, mm -hmm. the animals can smell them and it can know that this area is protected by this animal, uh, this male. Ah, so. Oh, and wow. the females, mm -hmm. what they do, they churn in a line. Aha, uh, okay. Not churn, mm, pull Kaka. in a, yes, in a line. Ah, so, okay. So, the males, they pull like this? Yes, one, one in one place, and females in a row. In a but row. The, and the reason for that is there is no time for females to sit on a toilet to pull, because they must look after the baby. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> That's why they pull uh, on a one line. Ah, the females so one. Interesting. Oh mm. wow. <laughs> you can also determine them by looking at them. Okay. By whether it's a female or a male. The the animals. Yes. The uh -huh. oryx. The female horns mm -hmm. are like you see like this open. Yeah, that's a and, female and horn. And the male horns mm -hmm. are close like this and straight and third no. Ah so yes, for to if they fight mm -hmm. they can even win the battle. Yeah. Ah, so okay. So many males. Aha. Interesting. This kaka, this poo is for a, a uh, hyena. hyena. Why is it white? They, because they eat bones. Ah, so. Yes. And sugar, mm -hmm. like yourself. Okay. I will just pour coffee. All right. And sorry for the person who is drinking tea because I can only offer coffee. Okay. <laughs> 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 But after a few minutes only. Okay. Sun eyes, you say, me? Yes. You call it sun eyes? Yeah, I call it sun eyes. Yeah. Okay. And they're beryllium or. Ah, but it's difficult to pronounce the word. Okay. Yeah. At least a few seconds. Okay. This is really opening up, yes. like you mentioned. 
this one is also opening there. That's a still closed. The one we are underneath is already open. Yeah, so see, see how it's opening. See how it's opening. Okay, this is a known as a camel phone tree. Mm -hmm. Camel phone trees are the indicator in this area that mm -hmm. there is an underground water uh -huh. because of the tap root system of the the tap root system of a camel phone tree. Mm -hmm. It can go up to 70 to 100 meters underground to search for underground water. That's why in this area uh -huh. you can see a lot of the camel phone trees are green. Yeah. Because of the tap root system is getting a water underground. Oh, so. Oh, wow. Time they put flowers. If they put flowers, uh -huh. it's an indication that these flowers is going to make an this nara fruit. Uh -huh, okay. In olden days, uh -huh. the top nut people, uh -huh. if they have stomach ache, uh -huh. they wait until it's light green uh -huh. and they eat it. Okay. For an stomach ache. Okay. And if they have open wound, open wound. Yes. Uh -huh. They take an oil of this nara uh -huh. and the root itself uh -huh. and mix them together and put it on and hold. Uh -huh. And in two days time, it's already done. Oh, it, it has healed? Yes, in two days time it's healed. Okay. Yeah. Going down. Going this way. You guys will okay. find me by dead flare. I can't continue anymore. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'll go down. I'll roll down. Guys, these dunes are so, so high. I'm dying. <laughs> so I'm rolling down and my guide will find me down there. Sometimes in life, you have to push yourself down. <laughs> Woo, ha -ha, guys, I'm tired. Woo. I hope my trousers, they don't tear because uh, I'm tired. Oh. I made it, guys. I have made it. Dead flame. Silver, you say this tree, these trees are approximately 500, 500 years old. 500 years old. The climb was worth it, guys. This view. Dead flame. This is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Because you only find this in Namibia. Apparently there used to be a river. And these trees, you know, they are alive. And then the dunes, they got higher and higher and the river was no longer flowing so they died up they dried up but they still remain standing <laughs> guys at this moment i'm proud to be born in this beautiful country namibia okay that's why right. they can never regrow yes never Okay. It will just stand as it is as it is now.
Okay. Yeah. All right. A new place, a new home for a while. Let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back. Take my time, just enjoy the ride. A new man passing by. Life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, something new, somewhere I can find myself. I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive As I reach out, reach out, reach out, reach out to the sky Two million years old Okay Mm -hmm. The river. Yes. Will we see water? Yes, but only small water. <laughs> okay. Yes, only small water. Okay. In the rainy season, uh -huh. the, when the water was flowing, mm -hmm. it ran up until the end. As you can see, the water mark yeah. on the stones uh -huh. are full. This year? Beginning of the year. So, yeah. were people swimming here? Yes, the lucky one. Like you're in <laughs> Jerusalem. Don't wanna be shy